Hello and welcome to another episode of my daily move room videos. So I've just done a simple savvy video for the Game of Thrones Magnus I did, but I said I'll do a another one for somebody else. So I'd ordered two more of these alien figures. These were $7.99 with my discount. Came to about $7.20 or something, I can't remember exactly. Um, so these are all the last of that price range that I didn't have. There were some, at least one eight ninety nine one could have got, but most all might get in the future. And the rest, I think, all a bit more than that, all the ones I've got. Um, I think these ones I've looked at in the past. Um, so this is, first one, is made in three. It's Wayland Utani Commando. I've only seen any three once, and it was a while back, so I can't remember too well. There's the details on the back. And there's <clears throat> just an example of the ones. I think the backs of these are all the same. Just got a bit more information about Alien 3 there. Again, I'm not keeping these in the box. Um, even if they're windowed, I won't keep them in the box, so I'll keep them on display. So, <clears throat> just come with a magazine. I'm sure I had one of these, well, magazine, booklet thing. I'm sure I had one of these without one of the booklets. You've got the basically. What's on the back, sabotaging the other ones. You've got a bit about in three there, you've got a bit about that. I think that's slightly different to what's on the side of the box. And you've got a bit good picture. So, again, this one's um, 117 millimetres tall, so it's 11.7 centimetres, so it's 12 centimetres. Let's figure. Um, luckily, these two are obviously not broken, but there's nothing like fragile on them sticking out, so. Let's search this one. So you've got the usual thing on the bottom, so Alien 3, Wildland Utani Commando. And then the other one I've got. Now, the reason I'm not keeping this box, because obviously someone would probably return this, that box is completely bashed in there. But again, it comes in like the other one, it comes in a plastic thing protected, so it's fine. Uh, the box is a bit dirty, I think. But yeah. But. See, that could have damaged the magazine, but obviously damaged it at the front. And the magazine was at the back, so the rest of the box is fine. It's just that bit, so the magazine survived. Uh, I don't know if the plastic got dented, I couldn't see. <clears throat> or it's got pushed out of place a bit. This one's 110 millimetres tall, so it's not as big. So I think there must be to a scale. Uh, so obviously I'm 6 foot 2 and someone's 5 foot 6, then obviously the figures won't be the same size. There's a bit about alien 4. Although... It's not really called Alien Force, it's just Alien Resurrection. There's a... Uh, on the side. I haven't seen Alien 4 for a or Alien Resurrection for a long time, so... Yeah, I suppose they put Alien 4 there because they come for Alien Resurrection and there must be a title must be known by somewhere. But yeah, you can see the massive dent on there, but it's going in the bin, so it's not really a problem. So they've got the figure here. Details are right, it's a bit generic, you know, you so you pay more for these, you get very much more detail. It looks like the characters are like usually a 150 pound Doctor Strange one and it look like Bendy Combat, whereas cheap one will just have the, the likeness of him. So we'll get to so much detail. But yeah. The bit that would could have been broken is these. These are like a glossy sort of texture, but obviously that if it's going to get broken, it would be one of those fingers, but they were fine. So, yeah. These are good, they are decent quality these figures. They've got a good weight to them, a good size. So, obviously, if you want to pay £150 for the big ones, then fair enough. But, you know, I don't really want to spend that much. Even if it's a character I really liked, and I was only going to buy one, I think I'd be a bit put off spending that much on one. But for £8, you know, you can't go wrong. Again, it's all part of the Alien Predator figurine collection. And you've got the same bit there. You've got in English, French, German, and I'm assuming Spanish. And then you've got the bit about Alien Res all those called Alien Resurrection there. So I don't know why they did Alien 4 on the back of the box. But you've got the figures there. And I've, I don't... 
that's the one I had, which was damaged. That's the one I really wanted, but you know, obviously after that, I was really fragile. Um, I've got a couple of predator ones, but I wouldn't mind some of those ones. And then you got another predator one there. I don't know if I fit in that one. Is you know, it's not like they're completely sturdy. You know, if you bend something bizarrely, it will break. But um, yeah. So I probably won't get any more of those for a while, but now I've got about nine. So I'm looking to probably put these somewhere else on display. But for the moment, I've just got on top of a bookcase and the rest are lying around. But yeah, that's it for this video anyway. Thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon.